Well, I never thought this would become a multi-part saga, but it did. We're still looking for a speaker that has good sound, but it must also have a very strong FM tuner. Now I found a speaker like that for myself and ever since then some family of mine were also looking for one but we couldn't find that exact one in the store anymore because I took the last one and we have actually tried to get it from another branch they did not have it so now we're trying out different speakers in the hopes of finding one that will play the radio just fine in a particular room in a particular house this is the one we tried out today unfortunately no, it is a failure. The FM tuner is so weak it cannot at all catch the same analog radio stations or well this one actually doesn't catch any radio stations where that speaker I was referring to earlier caught the radio station just Perfectly! Anyway, let's have a look at what we got here. I'm a little disappointed because this is actually a JVC. So we were expecting high quality and a strong FM tuner. And unfortunately that is not what we got. But what do we have here? Let's have a look. This one is the JVC Flamelight Trolley Speaker. Very nice looking on the packaging and it is actually very nice. This is the XS-N5212PB. It has Bluetooth, FM radio, if only it did, MP3 playback, remote, built-in rechargeable battery, mic input, USB TF card input, auxiliary in port, Bluetooth version 5, TWS function, that is if you want to connect two of the same speakers, like say for example you're gonna use it in a big hall, Flame light, auxiliary, line in, remote control, microphone jack, guitar jack, FM radio, USB TF card, power watt, 40 watts, built-in rechargeable battery, dimensions, you can read them there, uh, made in China, and so on and so forth. Yes, it is that FM radio feature that sold me on this thing. Unfortunately, I was very disappointed when I did not get that. Let's unpack it. There's your baggie with a remote control, batteries, cable, stereo cable. And let's take out the device now. It comes packaged with a microphone. Neat if you want to do karaoke. There's your speaker. Got a hole in the back so I'm gonna expect good bass from it. And of course, you, yeah, this trolley effect. We've seen that on a lot of speakers now. And you got your wheels. Uh, you don't have a hole to put it onto a pole. There it is when it's off and there it is when it's on. Beautiful display I must say. Really a nice aesthetic. It actually changes colors over time. Very nice. Here is what it looks like on top. You can plug in guitar, mic, auxiliary, TF card, USB, power, treble you can adjust there, bass you can adjust there, guitar volume, echo. This of course is the mic volume on and off switch. Volume, mode and so forth. Repeat, Bluetooth, this is where you change the lights can change it to yeah different light modes I think I like this flame effect best now let's change the mode to FM FM mode and let's see if we can catch some stations easiest is to just type it onto the remote we'll type in let's try and catch Eris here one oh one two and as you can hear, didn't catch any station. Yeah, unfortunately. Let's try another station. Let's try 94.4. Again, nothing. Absolutely nothing. That's very disappointing. So, unfortunately, there you have it. This thing's radio tuner absolutely does not catch any stations. I thought it might be just in that specific location that the purchaser tried to use it in. But uh, no, now I see even here where I am, I cannot catch the station at all. That's really sad. So, I'm afraid as a radio tuner, no, it does not seem to work. Well, I suppose we can listen to some uh, sound quality at least. Let me plug in a little USB sticky.
I do like the sound quality so far. Let me just stand away a bit so I can judge the sound accurately. <laughs> I listened to quite a few songs now, different songs, sound quality, I couldn't really complain. It certainly does have enough volume for a biggish haul. So I'm actually starting to like this thing more and more the more I listen to it. I'm starting to wonder if I shouldn't maybe get it for myself. The only drawback I could find is, as we stated, the FM tuner doesn't seem to be able to catch any analog radio stations or any FM radio stations for that matter so I suppose you're not gonna be able to listen to the radio with this thing but for other purposes like just listening to music I think I like it I hope you also like the video please hit the like button subscribe if you're not subscribed and let's talk about more stuff next time I now have to figure out do I want this thing is it a want or a need yes it's a want am I gonna keep it anyway I don't know I have to think about that one but as for you thank you for watching stay cool Psst.